Hi, my name is Paul Halliday and today we'll be looking at the JSON to TS extension within Visual Studio Code. So if we had a JSON object that looked like this, for example, it has an ID, it has a name, username, email address, and so on. So it's fairly standard and we are working on an Angular or TypeScript project and we want to add static typing to this. So we could go ahead and make our own interface. So we could, for example, start exporting an interface named user and then start adding things like an ID of type number, name of type string and so on. This does take a long time and of course it's error prone, but I do have a solution. And that solution is the JSON to TS plugin. So what you need to do is head over to the extensions tab and type in JSON to TS and install this into Visual Studio Codes. You can see that it has nearly about 30,000 people that's installed it so far. And you can actually use the website for this. But if you don't want to use the website and you want to use the extension, you can of course copy the JSON object to the clipboard and then hit Control Alt V. So let's do that now. Let's hit Control, Alt, and V. As you can see, instantly we get the interface, but not only that, we get a numerous amount of sub interfaces too. So each time we have things like an address and that would give us a nested object, we then have a sub interface here for address and things like geolocation and so on. So this allows us to create interfaces for our projects quickly and easily. And then of course, go ahead and use it inside of our actual project by exporting this, for example, as user. And then if we don't want to export all of these sub interfaces, we don't have to, but of course we could if we wanted to. So let me know what you think inside of the comments section below. Thank you very much for all the support of the Patreons and everybody that's bought the courses so far over at paulhalladay.io. Until next time, I'll see you very soon in that next video.